good morning guys how you doing so today I have my birthday just kidding not my birthday my nephew's birthday party so um, after work which I am right now currently it's like 8 o'clock in the morning very early um, today seems pretty pretty chill I mean this morning is not that cold like last morning like yeah yeah, yesterday's morning was just like crazily cold, like my my windshield was frozen and everything. But um, yeah, today seems pretty chill. I mean, I hope everything goes well with um the weather for my nephew's birthday party. Um, but yeah, after work I'm gonna go s somewhere to grab him with a gift because I forgot to get it yesterday at Target because I was too busy into um iPhone uh, tripods. But anyway, um. I'm probably going to catch up on some uh, Stranger Things right now until I get called. So, yeah. Q&A. Um, I started to feel really hungry, so I try to walk up to the over to the other hospital to see if the cafe is open. But um, the girls actually close. It closed at like 1030 and it's 1054 right now. So I walk over to uh, our cafe at this hospital. Um, it doesn't open till 11. And again, it's 1054. So... I got some time to spare. So I thought that and like to wait for, for a little while a little while for the cafe to open, I um I, I figured that I'll do a QA. So right here I have a um a question generator, so I'm gonna be answering the questions um that it asks me. So here we go. What do you usually eat in the morning? So um I don't really eat in the morning, like uh, as you can see right now, I mean it's still the morning time, but like I, I wait till re really late. Like I don't eat right when I wake up because like I start, I, I tend to feel re really nauseous. I, I I don't know if if it's the food or something, but um, yeah, I, I don't normally eat in the morning. I wait till like eleven or twelve. Next question: Do you prefer to take baths or showers? Um, I guess it just really depends on how, how I'm feeling the, uh, on a certain day because sometimes. I'm always on my feet, so like when I get home, I prefer a bath because like you know like a, like a nice hot bath because I um it, it lifts all the dirt up from your um, your pores and your skin. It feels nice, but sometimes I I feel kind of lazy and I I just want like a, a a quick quick rinse, so I take a shower. But I guess it just depends on a certain day. All right, next question. Who was the last person you had a good conversation with? Um, I would say my girlfriend. Uh, I believe it was about skating, ice skating. Yeah, we just wanted to go um, every week uh, on Fridays. I mean, if you check back on my uh, second vlog, uh, like you, you will see both of us are uh, ice skating. But um, yeah, it was just about ice skating, and uh, we, we we agreed on going every Friday. So um, yeah, because like she she's passionate about that, and um, I, I'm I'm not that good at ice skating, but like I'm good enough to make her um like to teach her to skate because she's like so generous about it. So yeah. Next question. What do you think your life would look like in ten years? Um. I guess it just normally depends on my passion at the moment, but like right now, I, I, like what? Let me see. What my life would be in ten years, like from now, like from my mindset from now, is that I'll be a doctor, an anesthesiologist, um, just working in the medical field. Um, yeah, vacationing sometimes. Um, married, probably see myself married to my girlfriend. Um, but yeah, but like maybe that I, that'll all change because I'm I, I feel very passionate about doing this this camera thing for YouTube, so uh, we'll see what it happens. Like, cause like, I don't know, like I, I have to gain an audience right now, and this this right here is is the process of getting this audience that I want. But um, yeah, I look I look like um in ten years just a doctor. Would you prefer to live in an urban area or a rural area? Uh, I think I'll... Uh, I don't really know the difference. 
one second. Let me look it up. Urban areas. I think rural is um, the suburbs, right? No, rural is like open wide. Uh, I think I, I'd rather live in an urban area because I like to have people close to me because like, I mean, I don't want to like say, say I need to go grocery shopping. I don't want to like, like ha have in the mind like, oh, I got to go 10 miles to buy a pack of eggs or a carton of eggs. Like, I like to have my food right there and then. Like, I, I'm, I'm very fat. As you can see, I'm talking about food and I don't want to go long distances for, for food. And like, yeah, I, I, I'd rather be like close in an urban area because I feel, I feel a lot safer because people are around me because of any, like, like yeah. Because if anything happens to me, people would know that, oh, this guy's in trouble or this guy got robbed or something, you know? I don't want to always feel like, hmm, I might die one day and no one would know, you know? So, yeah. How did you get your name? Do you know the meaning of your name? <laughs> um, it's basically passed down from generations. I, I have like, like four generations of Angel Dreamers. And I am the fourth generation. But, um, yeah, we have a lot of angels I don't know what it means, but um, I looked at my last name. Um, and, and it seems to be a, a country in Spain. I, I, I don't know if I have any Spanish heritage in me, but um, I'm Puerto Rican. so. And my first name, Angel. I mean, you, you basically know what the, the meaning of that is. Like, wise and um, enlightening. Like, I, like I, I guess I do can carry on with that name because I'm, I'm, I'm an, I try to live a nice life and um like be kind to people you know but um yeah what website do you visit the most uh google i mean it's easy to tell everyone does it too i mean i, I looked i look up everything on google so yeah what is the biggest priority in your life right now hmm um I would say school, and then my secondary priority would be my girlfriend. No, yes, like my family, because she fits into my family. She's she's she is my family. Like, like she's my girlfriend. Wait, that's that sounded really wrong. Anyway, she's in the family. Okay, so cool. She's my girlfriend. My secondary priority. My first priority would be um school. Anyway. How many pairs of shoes do you own? Um, I don't really know. I'm gonna skip the question. I don't have many. I have two Yeezys though. Two pairs of Yeezys. Um. Anyway, next question. Um. What would you do if you couldn't use the internet or watch TV for a month? Uh. I guess I'd just run. I don't know. Maybe just run, jog, and stuff like that. Wait, but doesn't that mean... I mean, I, I like to run with a watch on that tells me my pace. But, um, yeah. I'll basically just run and sleep and eat. Pretty much it. <laughs> uh, next question. Um, would you rather be stuck in a house with someone you hate or be stuck in a house alone? I I would definitely be uh, I would choose to be stuck in the house alone. The reason is is because I like to be free of of what I do. Um, like uh, this is, this will make me look bad, but I I want to be messy when I when I want to be messy, and like I want to clean up when I want to clean up. You know, I don't want to I don't want to cringe and all that stuff. Like Ooh, uh, she's not gonna like that, or like you know. But obviously, I don't want to be in a house where uh, I hate someone. I mean, that would be kind of brutal, and there, there, there may be fights. But, um, yeah, I'd rather be in a house alone. I mean, um, in my early childhood, um, I was always in the house alone, eating, watching TV, and I was just fine. Like, left alone. Like, I don't know. It, it, it's kind of good, but it's kind of bad at the same time because I haven't, like, explored anything. Because I'm, like, just now exploring, like, stuff because my girlfriend, like... Like she brings up plans and stuff like that, like that I, I I wouldn't normally do alone, you know. But um, yeah.
if you could invent a holiday, what would it be? Um, give me one second. Transport. Okay, I'll be right there. No problem. Goodbye. Um, oh yeah, if you can invent a holiday, what would it be? I feel like it'll be a day of free food. Where we give out a lot of food amongst uh, people, homeless people, you know, people pe people that are like very inviting, that 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 want to interact with other people. Like, I want a day where we just give food away, where food isn't like a an expensive thing. It's not it's not a luxury. It's just what you have and what you need in your life. Like, you can't live a day without food. So, I think. Um, that, that that'll be like a very humane thing to give food away and then give it give it for free to anyone like not not judging at all about what their values are and and their morals but just just give out the food make them happy make people happy that's 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 my that's my goal that's the reason why I want to be in the medical field because I want to make people happy I want to make I want to, I want to make people alive you know that's a good uh pun anyway Last question. When you were younger, what did you want to do when you want, when you grow up? Uh, I want to be an astronaut. I mean, I, I've always uh, been into astronomical things like uh, the space and uh, Saturn and stuff like that. I've always wanted to go to Mars, too. So I know that um, there have been theories where we could live on Mars at this moment because there's water on it. I, I'm, not, I'm not too sure about that, but that would be really cool. And then I uh, I heard that Virgin is doing a um, a launch pretty soon, but uh, it's like a million dollars a seat. I don't have that money, so I wish I did to um, have that money to go on to that. That that'd be great, but um, yeah, that'll be like a life goal to me to go to space. I mean, it's it's kind of cool. I love it. Um, but yeah, that concludes uh, your Q and A um, on on the road with the vlog. So, we have to go to Five and Below, and then my, my nephew's birthday party. So I'm gonna go to Five and Below, grab some, some presents and whatnot for him, and then go to the birthday party for a little while, and then get back home, because I have some homework to do, but. Let's go! Hey guys, so I just got out of uh, Five and Below, and I found this universal um, car mount for my mobile device. So, tell me how it looks from right about now, how does it look? Does it look good? Good, good. So, one second. And then I got one of these, these uh, car chargers, because I bought this one. But this, this is the only thing I want. I wanted to buy. But I had to buy this whole thing. This thing, whole, this whole thing cost twenty dollars. So I'm gonna take this back right now. Just let me safely put this in here. But I feel so much better with this thing on here. Oh my gosh, that looks good. But um, yeah, I'm gonna target real quick. Uh, return this, get my twenty dollars back, cause uh, I need that back. <laughs> cause I, I'm not rich, boy. Ah! Even though I work at a, at a, at a hospital, you know, anyway, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. But um, one second. Oh my God, this this packaging is just interesting. But yeah. I'm going to keep you posted on what I am going to do, but I'm definitely going to return this. I better have my receipt in here, because if not, then I am screwed. I do! Yeah! Okay, ready to go. Apparently, I bought Velveeta. <laughs> or, Velveeta. Oh, anyway. So, it's time to turn this. Kindly. Well, let me open this thing. How, did, how does it look? It looks, it looks, it looks like the slimmer down version or something. But, um, it looks cool. As you can see, I'm not one of the best people at opening packages, but I mean, this is all I wanted though, so I won't be returning this anytime soon. Oh, oh, it works perfectly, guys. Guys, you should, if you don't have one of these, go to find below, dude. Perfect. Five below, what would I do without you? Anyway, time to go to Target. So 
I know I didn't film anything here of me going into Target, but um, I did go in Target to uh, get my refund, and this is the video where I freak out or excited about getting all my money back. So look at this. So I'm back. I got exactly $22.67 back from Target. Good job, Target. I appreciate you for uh, refunding me twice. But um, anyway, that's like $22 pizzas and 67th of a pizza in New York City, okay? So, you know what? Thank you. Appreciate the money back. But anyway, time to hit my uh, my nephew's birthday party. So, oh, and I forgot to show you something. I got him a little Nerf gun type thing here. From five below. Five bucks for this thing. It comes with darts. It comes with everything. And it shoots up to 50 feet. Oh my gosh. He's gonna hurt somebody. Anyway, let's go take this to him real quick. And um, I'll see you there. So I'm here now, so I'm ready to walk in. I don't think he knows that I'm coming. But um, let's see how this works. Thank God this phone is waterproof. But let's see. Hey! Mama. I love you. Look, look at my, look at my stylish mom. Stylish? You call this stylish? Look, look, you made boots work. She made rain boots work with foot pants. Like, there's nothing better than gold cookie, huh? She made the rice. This, this is the woman that makes the best rice right here. I must warn you, uh, the video that's coming up right now has profanity in it, so if you have any children at all, um, please just uh, acknowledge that, that there is some uh, foul language uh, in the next video. Thank you. This is my other pain in the ass. My brother. He's an ugly motherfucker. He farts all the fucking time. Even in front of people. No. That's my boy. There he is. <laughs> the player. <laughs> so yeah, that is my family. Um they're they're amazing people. Um, uh, if you're Hispanic, you must know that if you leave a party, you always get a plate of food. Here's what I'm talking about. My mom fixed me up some rice and peas with some ribs, and it's, it's out of this world. It's so good. Like, when she makes the party food, I'm over there. Like, you, like you know that. Like, or, or, or my sister-in-law. She's Italian, and she she learned to make uh, Hispanic food, like the Puerto Rican food that we make here. But um, yeah, I'm I'm over here. So when I heard that either one of them was making food and stuff like that, and, and of course it's my nephew, so I had definitely had to be over there. But um, yeah, my nephew got scared. I'm gonna enter the video right here. So. Yeah, so now what I'm gonna do, I have to go pick up my money from my father because I'm paying monthly for school. So, I, cause I don't, I, I'm not really into that um, taking out loan stuff. I don't like taking out loans. Like I'm, I'm trying to avoid that as much as possible. So that, that, that's why I work two jobs um, and, I, and, I, and I go to school full time. So I, got, I, I can get my bachelor's degree and everything. So yeah, in four years. And it is pouring out right now. That's why I didn't film me coming out of the house. But uh, yeah, I said bye to every, everybody. And um, oh, and actually, my my knee. Oops, I just ran the stop sign. Oops. Um. Yeah, my niece just got this um this hamster thing. I I was holding it in my hand. This thing this thing this thing bit me. It was it wasn't like a big bite. It was like a nip, you know. So. Um, yeah, after I go get the money, I, I'm gonna go to Kung Fu Tea and then um, for the girl, and then I'll go go home. So I think I'm just gonna end the vlog here. 
Um, before I forget, uh, like, subscribe, and comment, and share it, please. I want this 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 positivity that we got going on here to uh, to go around. I mean, I I would talk about positive things all the time. Like I, I'm 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 willing to make people's day, like a, a person's day. Like I'm willing to make a person's day by watching this vlog, you know? Because I want I, I like enlighten, enlightening people, you know? Like to say let's say if you're like facing like uh, discrimination or something like that, like or um. Or is it neglecting and stuff like that? I'm here. Like I'm, I'm here for you guys. Like I'm, I'm here for the viewers and and, and whatnot and the people facing this stuff. I'm, I'm here for you. So you can contact me um, through my Instagram. You can, you can DM me, whatever you want. I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll be here. So yeah, if you need any help? Help me out. Or I'll help you out. All right. Again, have a good day.